Is it raining? Oh, c'est pas possible. What is it? You speak French. No, c'est pas possible. <laughs> um, <laughs> Bonjour, Vogue! We're in Paris. We out here shopping for we. We're actually here getting ready for the Balenciaga Spring Summer Show, which I'm really excited about because I love spring summer collections. They always have joy in them, light in them. They're a bit sexy because there's less like fabric typically to keep you warm. It's really my cup of tea. I'm going to the show with my friend Kim Petrus. We have a song that just came out, and then we're gonna run amok around town afterwards. That is if I don't fall asleep. This is my team. Here we have Hung, he's the master of the face, and Andrew, the master of the hair, and Mo, the master of the nails. And they are all transforming me because I just got off of a flight from Australia and I have no concept of what time is or the day. Clem, full face makeup, but look like she had no makeup. I know that's the craziest part is he will do my face for three hours, but it'll feel like I just woke up. Uh, no makeup, makeup with a lot of makeup. Great. Does it make sense? Well, yeah, I want my money's worth. <laughs> She's expensive. I haven't seen Katie since COVID, but we used to work together quite a lot, actually. Reunited today. Yes, the gods opened the clouds and mm -hmm. sent hug. One of my secrets is that I can stay watching all of the makeup artists with one eye. I've trained myself <laughs> so that they always know I'm watching. <laughs> The first thing I do when I get to Paris, it depends. It depends on what I'm coming here for. But I love a hotel room. And I walked into the room and there was a chocolate Eiffel Tower. So I bit the top off of it just to make sure it was chocolate. And I showed it to my daughter and she loved it. I'm really excited about my outfit because it is very representative of how I feel and see myself in the world stylistically, which is still maintaining a sense of humor and irony and sarcasm, but on a very high, chic, streamlined level. So today I'm wearing what looks like a couple of duffel bags reconfigured for my body. And that's what I love about Balenciaga. They have a sense of humor that like, they're very self-deprecating and they like to lean into the opposite, but in a very dark, dark sense of humor way, which is very me. I'm not making much sense because I haven't had much sleep, so. I will take that latte. <laughs> Everyone's asleep in there. Look at these nails. They're magnetic, but they're matte. They have a small sheen on them. For the hair, what we're doing is we're maintaining Katie's length and the length of her hair is absolutely stunning and gorgeous. It's a statement within itself. It's pretty and long. It's long and it's gorgeous. And so what, what, what we're doing is we're giving her a flat iron press to give a natural 90s kind of messy texture. Like it's worn in, it's been lived in a little bit. Why are you using this string, Andrew? To take down your volume. Make it flatter to my head. Exactly. You can pull it up at the same time. <laughs> kind of. I don't necessarily need no, it. No, your face is so snatched right your now. Your face is snatched. Orlando's gonna have fun trying to cut this out of my head when I get home. So I've worked with Tatiana Waterford for about four years and she's been great and she's really helped me streamline She's got a strong opinion and I've got a strong opinion and so we we do get out. I feel like my style has evolved a lot, especially in the past five years. Um, I can still have a sense of humor and it's nice to bring it up a level. I feel like it's a little bit more grounded 
a more streamlined, I'm an edge of your seat kind of girl. I like to keep them there, you know? Surprise is the best form of attack. Oh, this is what I'm wearing. I'm not gonna wear a purse, but it has a lot of pockets. And I was thinking like, maybe I put some things in the pockets. I'll bring it like a touch up to be in there. Maybe I'll put a macaroon in there. All right. Okay, yeah. next time you see me, I'll be in Balenci. And here I am. It's in the bag. <laughs> I feel great in it. It feels like a just come straight from the airport and I am my luggage. The details are fantastic. I'm not gonna bring a purse because I can actually pack pack it my brassiere as the purse. So I'll be pulling things out of my dress all evening. These are my lipsticks. I'll put my phone in here. Macaroon. Luggage. What do you think? Oh my god, you look gorgeous. Gorgeous! Hi, Queen. You look so cute. How do you feel? Great. Amazing. I'm so excited. Yay. It's my first Balenciaga show. Oh, nothing like the first time. We have a song together called Gorgeous, and um, it's one of the best verses I've ever heard from anyone. And it's one of those uh, ones where you just like turn into it and you're gorgeous. It's a reveal song, you know, like it's like the before and after song. Da Vinci, Da Vinci, my body. Pass me a shoddy. Don't want the cup. Pass me the shoddy. We are ready to go to Balenci. So ready. Thank you, Vogue. We love you. Thanks, Vogue. Be gorgeous. Yeah, get gorgeous. So gorgeous. With us. You With are gorgeous. Us. You are gorgeous. Thank you.